today we are going to discuss magnetic effect of electric current last year you have learned about a magnets fun with magnet chapter in that you have learned that some substances they behave like they attract the other substances like magnet it attracts iron cobalt and nickel so here we are seeing sometimes sometimes not always what happened when the current is passing through the uh, wire that time the wire behaves like magnet here we are going to prove uh, proof uh, prove this with the help of an activity so this activity is what to see the magnetic effect of current passing through a wire okay here we will take what material we will use we will take one cell of 1.5 volt you can do this activity in home here we expose the wire and we tape this or stick this with the minus terminal and this wire we will wrap on the magnetic needle all you know magnetic needle you have seen last time we are going to just make one loop of this wire on the magnetic needle and the other end children when this is exposed okay when we touch what will happen the current will when we touch it the current will start flowing and we will see the needle first it was in this position it is deflected it is deflected so this deflection tells what that when the current start passing okay when current start passes through the wire it behaves like magnet and therefore magnetic needle deflect deflected okay of the compass so now here we have proved this that uh, there is magnetic effect of electric current now i am going to tell you more about electromagnet what are electromagnets children electromagnets are magnets when electric current is passes an electromagnet is a device that acts like a magnet when electric current is passes through it okay it loses its magnetic properties when the current is switched off how are we going to make it what we do we take soft iron soft iron and we will take long wire children here two things are very important for for the strength of magnet two things are very important for the strength of magnet first thing the length of wire the length of wire here i am telling you i have taken soft iron soft iron increases the magnetism that is why we use soft iron core or we call it core okay here the uh, wire we take you have seen wire simple wire that is going to behave like a magnet okay we are going to wrap around it around this core number these are number of turns the strength of the electromagnets depends on number of turns number of turns means if length is more then number of turns would be more okay so strength of the magnet first thing depend on what length of wire or number of loops second is more current more strength more current more strength if we are using 1.5 volt battery and if we uh, the current is passing that is fine if we are going to use 9 volt battery the strength would be more so it is clear to uh, to you that the strength of electromagnet depends on what amount of current passing okay now this is our electromagnet generally electromagnets that are used commercially have long insulated wire wound this this is insulated wire wound tightly many times around the cylinder or core okay a piece of soft iron 
in the core increases the strength of electromagnet. Is this clear, children? Now, this is also called solenoid. What is solenoid? Now I'm going to tell you about solenoid. Solenoid is what? Electromagnet. Solenoid is what? Electromagnet. Okay. A solenoid is a long wire. It is a long wire that has been worn many times in a tight coil around a hollow or solid core. Many times. When you see the solenoid, you will find you are not able to see the core. It is tightly wound and you know this solenoid we use in so many electrical devices like pan and mixy. Okay, a solenoid is used, we use it as electromagnet. First time children, Hans Christian, Hans Christian, Orsted. It's, it is the name of the scientist. This is the name of the scientist. First time he discovered this thing. Orsted. First time he discovered that what he discovered? Electromagnetic, magnetic effect of electric current. First, okay. In which year? 1970. Sorry, 1777, first time this man had discovered magnetic effect of electric current. He demonstrated that a magnetic needle get deflected, gets deflected when it is brought near a current carrying wire. Okay, so in memory of this man, in CGS system, which system? CGS. CGS is what? Centimeter gram second system okay the unit of magnetic field unit of magnetic field is what or state okay when we measure the magnetic field we measure that in or state in which system cgs system is this clear now we are i am going to show you activity that this electromagnet attracts iron and children this activity I will ask you to do also. Well, how are you going to do this activity? In this activity you will take one iron nail okay iron nail and you take insulated wire insulated wire you means covered wire and one end you make free and this you wrap many rounds around this nail children you do this is not dangerous activity you do this okay and then you take one cell of 1.5 volt and just you attach both the ends of the wire fix it Okay, fix with the tape. And after some time, you bring some small thumb pins, nails and all, not thumb pins, nails or uh, stapler pins. You'll find this tip of the nail, it is attracting these uh, things. So this is, uh, the safety pin gets attracted to the iron nail. So what is the conclusion? Passing an electric current in a coil wrapped around an iron piece, make this iron piece magnet. Okay, make this iron piece magnetic and one more thing, as the current is off, it will not behave like magnet. Okay, so and I told you already the strength of electromagnet depend on the number of turns of the wire around the core and the amount of current passing through it. Two things you remember this. Okay, children. The iron nail attracts more number of safety pin when we are going to make more loops. Okay. We add more loops. It is going to attract more or if we increase the uh, strength of this power of the cell, also it is going to attract more cell. 
And next thing I told you, when we remove this wire from here, means disconnection take place, what will happen? It will not behave like magnet. Whatever things are stuck here, they will fall down. Okay. So, um, what I told you, the electromagnet magnet loses its magnetic effect when the source of electric current is removed. Okay, children? Okay, children, we are going to discuss uses of electromagnets. Electromagnets have a wide range of use in all sorts of devices. Okay, in ma maximum devices we use electromagnets. They are also used in cranes to pick up cars in a scrapyard last year, I told you. And also separate iron from garbage dump. They are also used in loudspeaker, telephones and in electric motors, electric fans, washing machines. So there are in various gadgets we use this electromagnets. Electromagnets they are also used in electric bell. Here I am going to explain you this electric bell, how this electric bell functions. Okay. I am going to tell you the steps. First step, um, for in first step you can also see in your book, when you push the switch, this is switch, okay, this is switch, when you push the switch, what happened? The circuit closes and the current start flowing. The current when start flowing, this wire, this is what? Electromagnet. This is what electromagnet, this behaves, uh, the, as the current moves, it behaves like electromagnet. The electro, this electromagnet attracts this, okay. This electromagnets attract this, uh, what do we call this armature, it is not given in the book, okay, electromagnet and uh, uh, iron strip, okay. Electromagnet attracts iron strip. And what happened, this is going to beat this gong. Okay. The hammer at, attached to the strip then hits the gong, making it ring. When the soft iron strip gets attracted to the electromagnet, it no longer touches when this setup, this setup, this setup, when it is going this side, what happened? It now no more in touch of a screw. So what happened? Yeah, this wire is attached here, a circuit is disconnected, circuit is disconnected. It is no longer touches the screw and hence the circuit is broken. Thus, this turns off the electromagnet and can no longer attract the soft iron strip. Again it will come back, because when the circuit breaks, then this magnetism is over, I told you, and it will move back to its position. Again, when it goes, uh, will go back and touches this screw, again the circuit is complete. Okay, the soft iron strip returned to its initial position, touching the screw. This results in the circuit being complete and currents flow again. So this process keeps on taking again and again. You have seen when the bell rings, the little interruption is there. Tick, 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 stop here. That is what breaking. So that's all. And okay, thank you, children.